new art. This week I'm going to take you through my process for doing my new portrait of the Ultimate Warrior. Uh, it's another one of my wet on wet approaches uh, where I take water uh, and just directly put it on the surface in the areas where I'm working and then once that's applied I take a dropper and just drop the ink right in there and then there's a few other things you can do like with a water brush like you know continue the the water movement out and the, the ink will just follow that path along it's pretty fun because there's no predictability to it like you've got to um, just kind of cross your fingers and hope it works out and luckily more often than not for me it's been working out so now putting uh, um, a little bit more on the face and uh, letting that work its way out I'm excited for the Ultimate Warriors fans that he's being inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame uh, this year in 2014. Uh, his fans love him. You know, every chance they get to see him on their screen, they uh, just really enjoy it. So I'm, I'm happy for them that uh, they're getting to, to see him grace their screen another time. And especially with a momentous week like the Hall of Fame and WrestleMania. Uh, now coming in with uh, a brush and some ink for some of the uh, more defining of you know the mask and the, the face. And with that in, now adding some background in because the composition just didn't quite feel like it was working. And adding now a little spot of green, uh, again wet on wet with some liquid acrylic. And then I also splatter a little bit in with a toothbrush of all things. And now uh, adding some red as well uh, to, to finish the effect. And some of the area to the right of his face was still a little wet, so it started bleeding out. And you just got to embrace it. And it still wasn't quite feeling balanced, so uh, fixing up that background a little bit more. Uh, but because of the minimalist approach I'm taking, you know, there's so much white here that uh, I have to really hope that. I don't overdo it because you can't go back from that. So you just add things a little bit at a time. You can see I splattered a little down in the bottom right corner as well uh, just to make things balance. And now putting a few, what, it, I, oh no. What's, The ancient spirits have taken over. I'm becoming the ultimate Shamburger. And there's the finished piece. Not bad. Cool stuff. Last weekend, I had the pleasure of attending the grand opening of Harley Race's new academy in Troy, Missouri. Uh, as part of the school, I'm super honored that they asked me to do 20 portraits of notable graduates of theirs. Uh, there's a who's who in there of both local all-stars and people that have made it up to the WWE. Uh, it, it's really an honor to have you know, even this uh, small, I guess, association with Harley and his school. Uh, the future really starts there. and. Uh, also, it was an honor to, you know, stand in front of all those pictures with Harley and get our picture taken. Cool times.